many shit. YouTube views you got? This is subscriber check. This is this is AD uh, who was Ice. All right, what's going on? What's going on, bro? This is uh my guy. I'm calling you live on the air. Um for those okay. listening. We live? We live. This is this is AD uh, who was formerly of No Jumper. Yes, sir. So we were just discussing what happened over there, and um, I said I wanted to give you a call so you could, you know, put your get, give your side out there, and you could tell us yeah, what really yeah, went yeah. down. And, uh, yeah, I was where should we start? It was a, it was a lot of. Um, I'm, matter of fact, I'm just gonna cut straight to the chase. Adam, Adam, you know he has a real big problem with accountability. You know what I'm saying? I looked at him as a, as a friend outside of the business. I had his back and I feel like a lot of the reason why I was hired in the first place was, you know, he knew my street connections and he kind of leaned on that and it ended up turning into like a, a, a business relationship when he seen how, how many people in his audience took to me. Mm -hmm. And yeah, yeah. And as time went by, um, as I was growing, he pushed me to start streaming. He pushed me to start doing different endeavors. And, uh, once I, once it started, you know, becoming successful, I felt like he kind of, you know, started looking at me a little different. Just the, the power tripping started happening. And, you know, once you playing with the guy's livelihood and shit like that, like, we sitting there looking at it like, all right, look, we got to make sure that we straight just in case. And, you know, luckily, we started our own brands that were thriving and, you know, certain deals was coming our way and everything like that. Because in a situation like this, if um, we was dependent on everything, man, it's like... Our, our livelihood would have been cut off. Water would have been cut off just off the, you know. Hey, it's like, can we, you got any examples of this power tripping that, that you think was going on over there? Yeah. You That's know, when the, when the house phone situation happened, um, you know, he was getting a lot of, like, backlash for it. And, you know, we was telling him privately, like, hey, you're wrong for this. And, you know, then we went publicly on the show that we got and we was telling him like, Hey, no, nah, I guess he was like, you know, super stressed out about everything. And we, you know, was, we was on his ass about it. And he was just like, Hey, I'm thinking about cutting all the shows off. 